actual uh, monologue. Copy. Um, tell us your name and a little bit about your acting background. Hello, my name is Michael Barnett. As far as my acting background, I've been learning from teachers in Pittsburgh since 2016, Randy Kovitz, Cotter Smith, uh, the Ensemble Studio, and of course, reading on the subject, some LA coaching sessions, some other stuff there. Basically, just always trying to improve myself and my ability to be truthful on camera. Nice. Um, what types of roles at this point are you really excited about playing? Oh, excited about. Uh, whenever I get the opportunity to be somebody very unpleasant and or, mm, let's call them psychotic, that's always fun. Uh, for, uh, in general, for archetypes that might work for productions in this particular 48, we've got well-meaning man that turns out to be a psychopath. We've got dad that gets murdered. We've got just generally unpleasant person. We've got looming thug. We've got antagonist the protagonist cannot beat up, but then through sheer, sheer perseverance gets enough strength and well-being to then overcome me, the antagonist. So those are general archetypes that I tend to play. Uh, Occasionally, very occasionally, romantic lead. It's a, it's a good spot for you. Um, can you sing? Yes. <clears throat> no pain can be deeper, no life can be cheaper, no point at all if I can't love her. And so on. Uh, what is your range? Baritone. Funny you should ask. Yes, uh, with Tanya Lynn, with uh, Randy Kovitz, with members of the Society of American Fight Directors. Uh, also, most recently in Calamity Care film, I got to work with some folks and stab somebody in the face, get stabbed, and have my eye gouged out, which had some great special effects on when it comes out in 2025. That's awesome. Hello, my name is Michael Barnett. This is Joe Pitt from Angel, uh, excuse me, Angels in America by Tony Kushner. I can only tell when you take it terribly. Because it makes you red-faced and sweaty. And, and frankly, that's very often why I don't want to. <laughs> You're not pretty. Not like this. Th then ask. Ask. What the hell are you? Stop. Stop it. I'm warning you. Does that make a difference? That, that it might be one thing deep within, no matter how wrong or ugly that thing is, so long as I have fought with everything to kill it, what do you want from me? What do you want from me, Harper, more than that? For God's sake, there's nothing left. I'm a show. There's nothing left to kill. So long as my behavior is what I know it has to be. Decent. Correct. Not alone in the eyes of God. <laughs> All I will say is I'm a very good man who's worked hard to become good in you. You want to destroy that. You want to destroy me. But I'm not going to let you do that. 